Oh, did you see him? He goes, come on, let's go. Dude, our Anubis is awesome. Dude, he just went right through him. Oh, God. Come on. Come on. What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome. Welcome back to another episode of Pal World. That's right. How's everybody doing today? I hope you're doing good, because me, I'm doing so very epic. Because yet again, I have finished another breeding project. Uh, we have been working on many many things but uh this is my latest this is the kitsune and i have to say this guy has been a pain in the neck however after a long and hard work it's paid off and it's paid off big this guy's so important because it's a pretty good mount to go on however when we breed this with our astagon it gives us the what is it the shadow <laughs> it's one of those days the shadow beaks and um yeah check this bad boy at, uh where is it where is it where is it this one 100 in every stat and and that's in the uh the ivs and muscle head swift ferocious and lucky yeah it's got all the attack boosters and then also swift for speed so pretty stinking cool it is gonna be a monster and even more of a monster once we get it onto the shadow beak so i am super excited right now i am working on as you can see i have three stars i'm trying to get to my fourth star you have to condense 64 pals and uh, we're getting there. We're getting there. But I have literally exactly enough space to be able to do this. So we can't, like, get anything else to take up space. Or otherwise, we're going to have to delete something. Um, we can't, like, we cannot afford to do anything. So I think while we're waiting for all these eggs to be laid, we're getting close. We have, I mean, we got a lot more. But we're getting close I think we should go and take on some more of the bosses and, uh, you know, pal world bosses. So let's kick things off. I am going to be rocking my assault rifle. We got plenty of ammo. Where is it? Where is it? 800. Okay. Hopefully that's enough ammo. I've got my attack pendant two on. And for the party right now, I'm rocking my Suzaku Agua which is also, by the way, um, phenomenal, near, near perfect. And then a team of gob fins to help boost us, give us increased attack as well as attack there, as well as defense. And we are going to take on the fire boss. We took, we attempted, we like, you know, we, we saw what he was about and he rocked our faces. Yeah annihilated us but we weren't out to try and actually get them today i want to actually try and get them so let's see if we can do it if this is going to be powerful enough Whew, we got 10 minutes guys let's go flaris we got this guys i have faith i have faith All right, come on, buddy. I probably should have just switched up one of my moves. I'll be honest with you. Come on, get him, get him. Yeah, I shouldn't. I should have taken off the ice move. Come on. We're doing good, though. Come on. Dude, he's just standing there like a dummy. This is epic. Uh, uh oh no does he do lightning it's all right Kyogre's doing amazing all right you got this dude he's like aimed at us no 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 
All right, we're doing good, guys. Oh, no, 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 no. Not cool. Holy crap. Come on. Get him, Kyogre. If we can survive this, Kyogre is doing fine. Like, he's not even touching him. Oh, get out of there. Hot, hot. Dude, he put us on fire. No, no, go, 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 go. Oh, crap. Come on, buddy. You got this. How are we doing on ammo? Dude, we already went through half of our ammo. Dude, I think we got this. I think we got this. As long as I don't run out of ammo. Go. Dude, this is epic. Oh. Aim at Kyogre, not at me. Yes, get him, get him. Dude, he's not hitting him. All right, almost there. Almost there, dude. We definitely got this. Definitely, unless something really dumb happens. Yeah, baby. Boss eliminated. All in the day's work. Dude, that was epic. Good job, Kyogre. All right. We are doing awesome, guys. I can't believe it. We mopped the floor with that boss. So, yep, pretty cool. And to make matters better, um... All of our eggs for our kid sons are finished. So you know what that means. We get to finally condense to level five. So let's go ahead. Here's our perfect, perfect one. And let's start condensing. So we got a lot. 64 for the final condense. Boom, boom, boom. Boom and boom. We got it. Beautiful. So finally opens back up that box space. And we are going to use this Kitsune to breed our final, final guy. So let's go ahead and we are going to move these two out. So let's put these guys right there. And right there, and then we're gonna take this one, which luckily is a female. Bada boom. Let's go ahead. Let's grab this guy. Come here, come here. And bada boom. And we are gonna breed this with our perfect Astagon. And this will hopefully be the key to getting our perfect Shadow Beak. So, you know, at least I'm hoping. Now, what this is going to do is it's going to, because we already have perfect stat um, shadow beaks when I hatched out all the eggs. But what this is going to do is be able to give us one with lucky, which we did not have yet. So here we go. And then this guy had a 98 in health. Hopefully we can pass over the perfect 100 on the kit son. Let's go. Look at how strong I am. All right. Let's get these guys a going. And then we can move on to the next boss pal. Um, I'm thinking I definitely I want to get going on the Anubis breeding. So I think it's about time we try out Anubis. All right. Breeding, breeding. Perfect. So I'm going to let them lay insane number of eggs and we very likely can get the perfect stats that we want between the two of them. So hopefully that's a thing. Are you okay, buddy? He's being a little weird, but okay. The, that's why I went and I made these stations up here. Simply because this dude, they're, they're too big to do down downstairs. All right, beautiful. And we have all of our egg things opened up. 
So beautiful, beautiful day. Um, I also traded up a couple of our guys with uh, Verdash. Verdash is actually amazing because there's no reason to have so many Anubis at our base because we are doing like zero mining. And I noticed that other than crafting, crafting Anubis is phenomenal at as well as mining. But um, they end up having a lot of idle time. Well, I noticed that the only gatherer I had, like the only planter and gatherer that I had was Lileen. Well, these Verdash, they got a pep in their step, very similar to Anubis, but they can help with the planting, but they're also level three gathering and level two transporting, which you may notice Anubis is only level two transporting. So I would argue if you're not mining um, and you're not worried about crafting much, like we still have Anubis, um, this might be the better choice. So I'm going to try that out because I really need, in particular, I put down a couple of new uh, lettuce um, because the tomatoes seem to grow faster than the lettuce. I always end up, every base, I have more tomatoes than I have lettuce by like a lot, like almost three to one. So hopefully that catches up. And uh, also some people are asking about the cake production. It's really not that much. Like I was expecting that I'd need to be making like cakes up the wazoo, but I haven't even had to make cakes in a while given I had a lot. But um, they really don't burn through it with the uh, with the breeding. So I don't know. It's it's not that bad. I can easily maintain all four as long. You know, we're pretty late game and I've been good about making cakes. But then I'm making more cakes now. But it is really not that bad, at least yet. As we get to the later game, guys, I don't know if they take more cakes to uh, to breed with. But anyway, let's, I guess, go and do Anubis. All right, there it is, the Anubis statue. And um, I have to say, this is not a bad little spot if you're looking for a base that can get uh, primarily coal. And then look at this right here. We've got a metal ore as well. There's also sulfur real close by. Um, I've grabbed a couple of sulfur nodes already. Um, sulfur something we do not yet have a base for. And it's not like super necessary, but... You know, it's something I think about. It's something I definitely think about as uh, we consider where we want to move our uh, base location. So um, there's a couple of spots around here, too, that I have scouted out for a base. But anyway, what, you guys want some? Those Taco Tacos, they actually drop uh, gunpowder if you fight them. So not much, but, you know, it's something. It is a something. All right, let's make our way over to Anubis. Look at this bad boy. All right, we'll do a Hydra laser. Oh, look at it melt. Oh, did you see him? He goes, come on, let's go. Oh, crap. I didn't have my thing already. Oh, beautiful. Anubis is quick, though. Definitely. Ooh! Come on, come on. Holy crap. All right. that. Oh, no! Come on! All right. We're going to have to come back. That's okay. This wasn't the absolute creme de la creme one. Oh, you turd nugget. I got to wait, what, an hour before he respawns? Uh, all right, why don't we do some other bosses while we're waiting? Because I have to get an Alpha Anubis today. Like, it's got to be a thing. Oh, and look at that. It actually doesn't take too long for him to respawn. It seemed like it was one day-night cycle, which uh, for us, the daytime's twice as long. But, you know, I've just been going around and harvesting, and I didn't even need to take on another boss yet. Um, I found these Dumans. I didn't really take notice of it before, but they drop a lot of pal oil. So, um, yeah, I've been loading up on that. Um, let's see. What do we have for 
scenario today. Oh, 97, 81. All right. I think this is a pretty good one. Let's go for it. Um, I'm going to stay mounted for a little bit and just see how we do. Because we do a decent amount. All right. Come on. And his, oh, his attacks aren't that scary. We're high enough level. All right. Can we hit him? Oh, go, go, go. This is probably a pretty insane fight because I know a lot of people, this is one of the better ways to get Anubis early on other than breeding. All right, doing good. Doing good. Oh, I'm not going to do any more. All right, that's a 31. Come on. Yes, we got him. Epic. We got Anubis, guys, which allows me to start really breeding them now. That's kind of the rule that I'm making for myself. You got to capture them in the wild. Oh, this is great. I would have come here so much sooner. Get wrecked. All right. Awesome. Um, we do have Anubis, but let's go and take on the next guy. There's a couple more bosses that I'd like to do today. All right. I think next we're going to go after Siblex and um, Valet. Yeah, because both of those should be super effective uh, with fire. So we can switch up to our Ragnahawk. That'll be perfect. I could even go over here, too, and see if I can grab another Verdash. I've really liked them. Did you ever notice, though? I didn't notice this before. I think I might have only just uncovered this. There's two German Tides. I never noticed that before. That's crazy. That's probably great for farming them. Um, anyway, let's go ahead, swap up. Let's get our good one. Yeah. All right. Kyogre, you did good today. You did real good. But now, and these guys are both right at the same island. So, oh, and it's snow. All right, let's swap up to cold. Hopefully that's enough. And... Actually, this one we can just go right here. It's not even cold. This guy's actually pretty decent, too. I was debating. But uh, anyway, let's get her done. And enter dungeon. All right, we can probably stay mounted, to be honest with you. Ooh, I hope that doesn't one-shot it. Remember, we get... Uh... Ooh, we do a lot! We do a lot! I don't have a, uh, a little move on this guy. All right, should be good enough. And, oh, and beautiful. All right, cool. Do we have a chest in here? Really? I'm not seeing one. That's disappointing. All right, right at a statue of it looks like Frost Stallion. Let's go. Enter dungeon. Come on. Beautiful. All right, let's light her up. So she's a level 40. Oh, dude, look at how much we just go through her so quickly. Oh, no. Dang it. Oh, well. Well, we need to defeat her anyway. I tell you, I am so bad. I'm trying to get it so low, but what you going to do? All right. Beautiful. We already have a Silex. Anyway, we'll come back for it another day. Man, that went so quick, though. You know what? We do have the team, possibly, possibly the team 
And do we have enough ammo? We might. I could just try the tower over here just for funsies. I'm assuming I it would be at least neat to see what uh you know what's in store at this tower. Why not? Let's have some fun. Let's try it out. Let's do it. Join boss battle. Oh, that said that uh staff or spear, I think. Oh, Lyleen. Oh, man. Does that mean she's going to heal up halfway through the battle? I hope not. All right. Oh, dude, we are racking. Dude, look at that. Ooh. Come on. As long as I get... Ooh. It just got a heck of a lot easier. What the crap happened? Yes! Dude, that was nothing. Awesome. Ooh, five more technology points, too. We needed that. All right, sweet. All in a day's work, guys. All in a day's work. Oh, guys. Um, this might be even cooler. Check this out. Um, there is a lucky Silex right over here. I actually teleported to the wrong place. I went home to drop off. And uh, I teleported back here because I wanted to show you something. And yeah, we have it just right there. Um, let's take out this lower level one. Dude, we rack. All right, lower level one out. We got our legendary spears. We're definitely going to need them. Jeez. Come on. Ignis Rage. All right. All right. Perfect. All right. Get it. All right. Low catch rate. Go. Oh, man. She's a level 50. Come on. Come on. Yes, we got it. Oh, that might even be cooler. Lucky. Beautiful. All right. Very cool. Very cool indeedy. I wanted to show you. Yes, yes. I wanted to show you from here. Um, It's kind of cool. You can see our uh, metal and coal base right down there. Isn't that neat? I like that. I always, this is like in the back of my thumbnails because I usually do my thumbnails actually right over there. That's super sick. All right. Um, anyway, let's go. We have enough time. Let's go. I was debating doing Frost Stallion again, but I'm going to wait. I want to do uh, Kimpaka uh, Crystal first. So let's go Land of Absolute Zero. All right. The teleport is uh, right over here. And my best guess is it's in these Forgotten Mines. It's the only spot that seems like, yep, right there. So the dinosaur bones, boom, teleporters there. All right, let's find out. By the way, one uh, really good thing about Ragnarok is for a flyer, he's pretty small. So you can actually fly into most caves in this type of scenario. So kind of neat. Yep, there he is. Is there any chests? I've been trying to be good about getting the chests first. Boom. Ooh, look at that. Lightning bolt. All right. Let's do this, buddy. Let's do this. Boom, dude. Racking them. Ignis Rage. Take him down. Oh, 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 oh. All right. Oh. All right. 28%. 
Come on. Ooh, I got... Yep, we got him. Awesome! That is so cool. Is this something? Nope. All right. Very nice. Very nice indeed. And look at that. Some quartz in here, too. All right. Let's get home. What a day. This is Everything's just going so smoothly. Should we attempt Frostallion again? I'm curious. I feel like I'm so much stronger now. I, I don't know what it is. I mean, I guess we could have gotten a few levels. That might be. Oh, we could try it. We got a lot of stuff on us, but I don't know. I'm feeling pretty confident. Let's let's give it a go. All right. We should be at Frost Stallion. Oh, man. I hope I'm not getting too cocky about. Oh, that doesn't do a lot. That doesn't do a lot. Oh, man. Nothing like the other guys. No, 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 no. Oh, not nearly as much. Oh, all right. Let's grab the chest. I wonder if the chest is any different if you wait until oh, you defeat her. All right. Let's dismount. Go. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, go, go, go. Oh, go, 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 go. Why is my guy so slow now? That's it. That's it. Oh, crap. All right. We're in trouble now. We are in big trouble now. Oh, go. Oh, we're in big trouble. Big, big trouble. Go. Go, go, go. I probably should uh, get some. Oh, God, we're done. This is it. This is it. Oh, oh. Come on, health. Go up. Oh, Lordy. Fry him. No, 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 no. No, no, no. This really sucks that you ca I can't be more involved in the fight. Oh, yes. Fry him. We got to wait for our health to go up. No. No. Holy crap. That's it. That's it, birdie. Get him. Get him. Ragnarok. Oh, God. No. Ooh. Ragnarok is doing amazing. If only we... Nope. This way. All right. Let's go over this way. Come on, Ragnarok. Oh, we're out of stamina. <laughs> Come on, buddy. I have faith in you. Oh, God. Oh, God. No. No. Really? This is my best defense to just not get hit. And that's it. Oh, because I do such little. Oh, crap. Such little amounts of damage. It's just almost pointless. All right. Come on, Ragn. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, crap. Come on, Ragn. Don't miss with that. Oh, yeah. See, slowly whittling them down. Oh, God. Oh, God. I hate that it's the the AI on it is so oh is so smart like it knows how to aim where you're it's expecting you to move. Ooh. Come on. Oh, get that shield back up. You just 
just got to keep moving. Except for that one first time. This is the best that we've done. Oh, don't jinx it. Don't jinx it. Oh, God. Oh, God. Go. Go. All right. My shield's going back up. That's a good sign. Oh, come on. All right. Ragnarok still doing good. Come on. Hit him. Yes. Come on, buddy. Oh. All right. Getting them down. Come on. You got to hit him with the, that hit. The, oh, God. That's the one that we always have to have him hit with. All right. Ignis Rage. Oh, oh, oh. This way. Get. Oh, God. I'm not doing good. Not doing good. Oh, man. All right, Ragnahawks at half health. Come on, buddy. I believes in you. Oh, man. All right, shield's going back up. Oh. All right, this does block some of his hits. So just staying here. All right, I think we're in ball throwing range oh crap come on i don't expect to get them but it's worth it to try it 17 oh oh no oh crap come on seven oh man Ragnarok, do your move. I'm giving you time for your cooldown. Whoa, what are you doing up there? No! Oh, God. Come on. Come on. Oh, man. Eighteen. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Yes, we did it, guys. Oh, and we got legend. Oh, baby. What a day. I have to say, nothing has topped this day. We got our Kitsun perfect one. We beat two bosses, like, you know, the, the people bosses. And we got Anubis. We got, like, we got everything. What a stinking day. I'm so pleased. All right, let's get back to the base, guys. Oh, man, super sad phase. We don't get the Frost Stallion saddle until level 48. So, yeah, but it's okay. We had a killer day. Shiny, Cybelex, um, Alpha, King Paca Crystal, Frostallion, Anubis Alpha, and Valet Alpha. And we got some good stats on all these. Look, our Anubis 81 in the health, 97 in the attack. Our Frostallion, we got a 92 and a 91. That is super sick. Um, let's just take him out for a moment. For a moment. Um, bada boom, and why not? We'll grab our new Anubis as well. And let's get you back. All right, real quick. Let's just do, you know what I like to do with new guys. There we go. All right. Um, right. Let's try first our Anubis. Let's go. Dude, our Anubis is awesome. Come on, get him. Ready, ready. 
Dude, he just went right through him. He is sick. All right, all right. And get him. Oh. I cannot wait to ride Frost Stallion. Come on, Frost Stallion. Finish him up. Dude, he's so good. Oh my goodness. And uh, Frostallion is the first pal that we have that has legendary. So I'm going to have to see what we can breed Frostallion with to pass that down to other pals, hopefully. Come on. Dude, he's on the run. Yes. Dude, he's like, get the crap out of here. That is so epic. What an amazing day. And come next episode, we're going to be able to start hatching out all of our shadow beaks as well. But Frostallion, you are gorgeous. I'm so pleased. Anyway, guys, thank you all so very much for watching. It's been a pleasure, as you always do. Please remember to show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, please do not forget to subscribe for the daily Power World awesomeness. And also be sure to come check out the Discord. Come say hi and also come check out our Power World server. All right, guys. Uh, all the links are down in the video description. See you tomorrow. Thanks again. Peace out.